Hey there, this is Akshit Manan. Welcome back to a new video. And in this video, we are going to see one important keyword in Dart that is called implements keyword, right? To understand the implements keyword, you should be very much clear with the extends keyword. That is nothing but inheritance, right? So I'm going to write a main function over here, right? And a simple uh, two, three classes that are going to represent inheritance, right? So I'm going to have animal class, animal class, and in this animal class, I have certain function, let's say uh, walking. I have eating. Now uh, I can have another class that is going to extend this animal class, right? Now, as soon as I do this, you already know that whatever functions I have written in my animal class, they can also be accessed through the instance of this cow class. So what I mean by this is, if I create a cow, cow is cow, that means I'm just creating an instance of this cow class, then I can access walking and eating through this. Because whatever functions, methods, variables I write for my parent class, they also become uh, valid and available for my child class also. So this is my parent class and this is my child class, right? And I just wrote two methods for my parent class and I can access these two methods uh, through the instance of my, um, you can see eating and you can see walking, right? So this is okay, right? And you can see that I have not overridden uh, these two methods in my child class. But the first difference that comes when you use implements instead of extends is you have to override the methods there is no choice you don't get any choice that whether you want to implement it or whether you want to extend it or not if you implement it then yes you have to override it that means if i write print walking over here and i print eating over here then these two functions are not going to be available for my children classes right you have to define another walking function and another eating function for your cow class also. That means when you implement it, it's kind of an abstraction, right? You're just defining a blueprint that, okay, my child class is going to have walking function, eating function, and any other function. But walking for a cow is going to be different uh, from walking for a, a giraffe, right? And eating is going to be different for a cow and a giraffe and a cat and a dog, right? That means here we are just defining a blueprint or just a plan of my children classes, but you have to uh, override these two methods also. So this error you can see, this will be gone. If I just define uh, walking and eating functions over here, walking cow and eating cow, right? So now you can see that error is gone and now I can access uh, cow.eating, cow.walking uh, over here, right? So I hope this is clear. So this was the first uh, difference. So let me just write it down. So first difference is you have to, you have to override methods, right? No choice is there. You have to override the method. So this is the first difference when you get, when you use implement, you get this uh, different thing from the extends keyword, right? The second thing that comes is if I extend it, if I just write extends over here, and there is one animal class and I have another class that is mammal class, right? And in this mammal class, I have another function, let's say reproduction, right? Reproduction. And there is one method for this. Now, what I want is, I want this mammal also to be a parent class of this cow class because cow is an animal plus it's a mammal, right? So over here, I can say that this is also my parent class. Now you cannot extend animal comma mammal. You cannot have two parents for a child, right? A child is going to have a single parent, right? But if you use implements, implements, then yes, you can have two parents. You can have animal also, you can have mammal also. And there's an error because now you need to define, uh, you need to override this mammal reproduction method also, right? Because there is no choice, we have to have uh, method over uh, writing in, uh, in when we use implements, right? When you, when you use extends, then it's your choice whether you want to override or not. But when you use implement, you have to override all the methods. 
so i hope this was clear and let me write down write down the second difference and then we can close it uh, you can have multiple parents in case of implements implements so i guess this was clear this was a short video and this is an important concept in dart till the next part keep coding keep innovating and thanks a lot